Hello, and welcome to Mama T's Kitchen. I'm Teresa Philman, otherwise known as Mama T. Today, we are out in the garden to pick some apples to make some organic, fresh apple juice. We've chosen apples from three different trees, two reds and a green, and these apples are grown specifically for juicing. You wouldn't want to just eat them, they're a little tart. We'll be using the leftover apple parts to make some homemade applesauce. I hope you'll join us today to see how easy it is to make some organic fresh apple juice. We're back in the kitchen now and we've just washed the apples and now they we can now core and quarter our apples placing them into a pot of water. They don't have to be perfect apples because we can cut out any of the bad spots. I have completed the cutting process and as you can see there are random pieces um, they've turned a little brown since it took me a while to cut 50 apples. I did end up with two pots, so I have 50 apples right now and probably about 30 in one and 20 in another pot. So now I filled it with water and the water is just over the top of the apples. Some of them are floating. And now we will cook them. We will cook them approximately 30 minutes. We need to check on our apples. It's been about 30 minutes and I've stirred them once and a lot of them are breaking apart, which is fine because we're not going to be really using the skins or anything like that. I will be, I will be using a hand food grinder to grind the apples to have some applesauce, but other than that, we will not be using any of the leftover um, apple remnants. So I'm going to wait another 10 minutes or so, and then we will uh, proceed with making our fresh apple juice. 10 minutes has passed, and our apples are almost translucent. So now we will take them over and drain them. Now our apples have been drained, and the liquid has been put back into the pot. And now I'm going to add, because it, it is kind of tart right now, I'm going to add two cups of sugar. I have it cooking, and I'm going to dissolve the sugar into the juice so that at least it will be a little bit sweet. You'll want to uh, stir this until it is well blended and the sugar is melted, and then you can just continue to taste it and add more sugar as you need. It's better to add less sugar in the beginning because if you add too much sugar you can't really take it away. Also, you can always add liquid to it if it is too strong of juice. After you achieve the desired sweetness that you like in your apple juice, pour yourself a glass and enjoy. Pour the remainder into a sealed container and it will stay fresh for about one week. Otherwise, you can always can your juice and use it in winter. We've now completed our apple juice and we have all these leftover apples. So what I'm going to use is this hand food grinder and I'm going to make homemade applesauce. This is a basic food grinder. I don't want to promote a product, it's just this is the one that we use. It's a very good grinder, it's very easy to use does not use electricity at all because many times we don't have electricity here. I like to teach cooking that it's very basic so that you don't have to buy a lot of expensive gadgets and gizmos and so when we made our apple juice we just used apples right off the tree, no special apples, we didn't buy anything special, we added some sugar to it and it's done. Now we're going to use our leftover apples and make some applesauce. So basically all you do is take your apples and you put them into the machine. And then you just start grinding. So you've got applesauce coming out of here and the discard here. So we're just finishing up grinding our apples and we've ended up with a nice pot of apple sauce.
Out of 50 apples, we got about two quarts of applesauce. I will return this to the stove and add some sugar to it to sweeten it up a bit. And then, sterilizing my jars, I will can it so that this winter we will have some great applesauce to go with our cookies during tea and cookies. I hope you enjoyed our lesson today from Mama T's Kitchen of making fresh organic apple juice and fresh organic applesauce. Hope you'll come back and join us again. Have a great day.